In 1900, Charles W. Humphrey, a prominent citizen of Poultney, constructed his elaborate Queen Anne-style house for his new bride. More than a century later, the tired elegance of the building captivated newly appointed Green Mountain College President Paul Fontaine, who envisioned a higher purpose than the deteriorating storage facility it had become. Seeing the potential for a gathering place for the community, Fontaine also saw the opportunity to cultivate a more robust relationship between the town and the college. Inspired by the concept, local leaders wrote letters of support for grant proposals to raise funds for the renovation. Pulteney Town Manager Jonas Rosenthal confirmed the community's need for a meeting and events center and further endorsed the project as a long-needed facelift to one of Pulteney's gateways. With multiple major federal grants and gifts large and small from private individuals, the project became a reality. Exterior work included reconstruction of the rusticated marble block foundation, restoration of the wraparound porch, repairs to the purple slate roof, restoration of trim details and historic paint schemes, and the addition of an accessible lift. Inside, stained glass windows, parquet floors, pocket doors, and the original Queen Anne style staircase were saved and restored. and downstairs rooms were converted to fully equipped meeting rooms. The C.W. Humphrey House is now a place where all community members can gather for meetings, lectures, concerts, and social activities. But beyond the bricks and mortar of this spectacular restoration at the gateway to the town, the C.W. Humphrey House stands as a monument to the value and success of good partnerships between Green Mountain College and the town of Pulteney.